everyone. Today is October 17th, 2020. I'm going to take you through our workout. Workout's going to be a 20 minute MRAP. It's going to be five pull ups followed by 10 push jerks at 95 pound bar with, uh, for men and 65 pound bar for women. Uh, 15 deadlifts, same barbell, 95 pounds for men, 65 pounds for women. And 20 burpees followed by uh, 25 double unders. So we're going to lock on one of those workouts. So we're just going to uh, prep and go. So for the pull up, we're looking to establish a uh, standard for the pull up. So we're looking to do five consecutive reps in a row. Uh, for this workout, we can either, for our, for our X, or the RX version, we're looking for strict, uh, full range of motion. So full lock at the bottom, kipping pull up where your chin uh, goes over the bar, or a strict pull up, okay? So you can either do your kipping pull up, okay, or your strict pull up, and pull your body all the way up. A couple of modifications. Uh, I would start off with jumping pull-ups where you're standing underneath your bar. You jump and then pull your chin over the bar. All right. Um, and then we can go down to the ground. So if we're doing ring rows or bar rows, you could just lean back here and pull like this. But if we don't have a pull-up space, we want to grab a cannonball, a dumbbell, get hunched over, and just do an upright row. And we want to find a standard that we can maintain five reps throughout the workout. The next step is going to be 10 push jerks. So we're going to get the bar into the front rack position. We're going to dip, jump, catch, and then stay in 12. So once again, we're dipping, we're thrusting our hips up, landing underneath the barbell for that push jerk. You can also do this with dumbbells, but if we don't have um, any equipment whatsoever, even the pull-up bar, we're actually going to do 15 push-ups. So we're going to bring the upper body workout from the pull-up. We're going to take those five reps, and we're going to add them to the 10 reps of the push jerk, and we're just going to do 15 of those. The next step is going to be the deadlifts. So we're going to get into a hunched over position, back flat, hips over the knee, uh, uh, hips should be above the knee, tension in the hamstrings, shin vertical. We're just going to push, pull, push the ground with our leg, and pull the bar up and down. All right, so the barbell is very light. We have a 95 pound barbell for men, 65 pound barbell for women. So this should be unbroken. Uh, you should feel a stretch in your hamstrings. You should feel, you know, like you're doing work, uh, but it should just be grunt work. But we don't, what we don't want to avoid is just touching the ground and coming up. We want to make sure we're still keeping that back flat, maintaining good position so that we can save ourselves because it will add up to a lot of reps. The next step is going to be the burpees. This is where it's going to get Kind of tough in a workout we do have a lot of burpees per round it's going to be 20 reps so this is where you know it's going to hit the fan so you're going to go all the way down to the ground body to the ground bring your body back up jump and clap okay so we have uh 20 burpees and then a double under so we're just trying to get the jump rope to go around our body twice um if we're doing single unders we're going to do 50 reps but if we don't have any weight equipment we'll do 65 reps okay so once again we have five pull-ups 10 push jerks, um, 15 deadlifts, 20, I'm sorry, 20 burpees, and then 25 double unders. I'm gonna try to keep, complete as many rounds of reps, as, as many rounds of reps as possible in 20 minutes. Um, if you have any questions, feel free to reach out. Make sure you post your workouts for on modified. Have a good workout.